Happy New Year! It's Linda from Nutrisystem Live and this is a special Nutrisystem Live because this is the first time that we have done one of these and again Happy New Year and to all of you who are starting your new resolutions with uh, trying to lose weight or to get a little healthier uh, we're here to help you so I am here with my good friend Ryan and he's gonna talk to you he's gonna first let's introduce Ryan and, and get him to talk, tell you a little bit about himself. Hey everybody uh, Ryan uh, it's good to see you all and uh, anyone that's new um, I I, uh, I am the uh, lead um, for our social customer care here at Nutrisystem, so I get to see all you guys on our Facebook page and Twitter and stuff like that. It's been a lot of fun so far. So, um, been with the company seven years, and I was not a uh, weight loss counselor here for Nutrisystem as well. So, um, I have a lot to to share, and um, I'm looking forward to your questions. So, just a quick question for you. This is, I know food's a passion of mine. So has food always been a passion of yours, or is it food and the helping people? So just share with us. Now, yeah, I mean, I, I, if you've tuned in with us before, I'm a huge foodie. Like I, you know, I love food. Um, I love, uh, you know, cooking healthy foods, and um, I definitely love uh, helping people too. I mean, that's why I come to work every day. Uh, there's a lot of people out there uh, on our uh, our social channels, and you guys ask really great questions, and we love answering them and being there for you and trying to help support you and, and make sure that you guys are trying to have some success as well. So speaking of that, let's get to the question part because we had, so we, I posted, I did a post earlier and asked people if they had questions. Um, there were, um, there were some people who had some questions and one was, first one was Jill who said, where do we go for the Facebook Live? Anyway, Jill, I hope you joined us. So hello if you're there. And um, so Kathy Ryan Foster, so uh, I'll ask you, Ryan, to answer this one, that she says, I do not get the power car, power fuel thing. I need to read the, all the, I read all the pamphlets, but I still don't get it. I stick to it pretty good with the fruits and veggies. It's just a little confusing. So can you can you help her out with that? It's Kathy. Yeah, absolutely. Hey, Kathy. Uh, nice, uh, good question. Definitely a good starting off question. So um, with power fuels and smart carbs, your power fuels are going to be things uh, like your nuts, um, protein-based items, nuts, uh, lean meats. You can do cheese sticks, yogurts. Uh, depending on how much protein you're kind of looking to get, some people like a little bit more. You might go with like a Greek yogurt, um, something like that. Uh, uh, your smart carbs are going to be more of like your grainy items. You have uh, your breads, your fruits, dried fruit if you like to maybe throw that on top of a salad as a smart carb. Um, you can do different types of like whole wheat pasta, something like that. When you're choosing your bread, uh, some people will do like the wheat thins or if you have a you know a special type of bread that you like, just make sure it's like whole grain, um, multi-grain sourdough, you know, something like that. Um, with both of these, you're looking for both of them to be at least 80 to 120 calories. For uh, power fuels, you're going to look for at least five grams of protein, and for a smart carb, you're going to look for at least one gram of fiber. Um, your daily tracker, the pamphlet that you refer to, will show you how many of those to have for your day, um, and it tells you in what order to have them. But for everybody out there, if you are, you know, kind of, if you have a, a busy schedule or it doesn't quite fit the way that your schedule is, how the daily tracker is outlined, just remember that you can have things in the order that you want them you can mix them around and have like you know a power fuel later in the day or a smart carb earlier in the day um, just make sure that you're not trying not to go longer than two to three hours without eating at all times I'm with him I like to go less than two to three hours without eating so we do have a couple of questions about pricing um, so we had one from here another rose says it's too expensive and Debbie says on fast five. Oh, so we'll get to that yep. in just a second because starving is not good. Debbie, hang on, we'll answer that. So I want to get to the what's a more affordable way. Is there anything that we can do? So there, there are some things out there. So Ryan, will share with you. Sure. So we had a couple people talking about this. Um, you know, when you get on Nutrisystem, there are definitely different ways that you can um, make it a little bit more affordable with uh, going with maybe uh, frozen uh, items rather than uh, your fresh stuff. So. 
um, maybe like frozen vegetables, frozen fruits, stuff like that. Um, you might want to try to buy in bulk. Uh, a lot of places now, um, bulk is more readily available um, so that you can, um, you know, buy more for less. Um, and then uh, sometimes, you know, people will go with um, different, if you're going with like brand names, uh, items for your power fuels and smart carbs, they can tend to be a little bit more cheaper. Um, stuff like that. So, you know, looking for the deals and um, it, just trying to find where you can get more for less. Right, so great advice. I mean, finding that type of type of deals and things like that, they're great. So, Debbie says that she's on the Fast Five yep. and she's starving. <laughs> well, she's on the Fast 7 and starving. So, uh, Ryan will help you out. You don't need to be starving. Hang on. Yeah, hi, guys. So, um, I think Carrie, too, you, you said you started the Fast 5 today. So, uh, welcome, um, Carrie. Uh, so, anyone that's doing the Fast 5, um, it is a little bit, it is a jump start. Um, it's a little bit more restricted. You're not adding the power fuels and smart carbs in your first week. So, remember that on the Fast 5, you can have um, your non-starchy vegetables in unlimited amounts and that's I would say one of the biggest advantages that you have so you know throw in some like maybe dense leafy greens or some um, you know some broccoli you can use like I can't believe it's not butter spray or some type of zero calorie butter spray to make that in a pan or something like that um, you can use uh, a, a big one that we go with is Waldron Farms uh, salad dressing because it's zero calories so you can use that on your salads and things like that um, so and then also remember the water water is key here uh, uh, you can have um, really as much as you want. We suggest 48 to 64 ounces a day. Have a glass with wa of water with every meal. Um, really try to help fill yourself up. And then on top of that, just to the last suggestion is, um, again, you can move things around a little bit. So if you maybe want to have like one of your shakes or something later in the day, um, you can do that as well. Remember, two to three hours you can eat. It's a good thing. Anyway, so uh, I saw Ashley join, so welcome, Ashley. Hi. And uh, Lauren, love this program, lost 35 pounds and dropped up. Wow. Wow, that's terrific. And dropped because of the diabetic range and dropped out because of the diabetic range of it. Oh, well, we ha uh, so there is a diabetic program for those people who are diabetic. We love you, Lauren. <laughs> Uh, but we love you, and I love the program too. It is great. Is it effective? It is effective, and it, it works for people. It's a, you know, everybody has different needs, and there's different things that you can put in. You know, you can mix up those power fuels and those smart carbs to to really make it work for you. And then uh, Mary wants to know when the cost card. Do you want to answer about the Costco card? Yeah. So Mary, we have different savings on on those uh, throughout the year. Um, more information to come. Really, uh, right now they're available. Um, on Costco.com, um, and uh, we will, it, they'll definitely be uh, noticed when we have um, more information on when they go even more on sale. We love you, Heather. Thank Aww, you. Oh, hi, Heather. We love you too. So, I wanted to ask another question. Um, so, people are really jazzed about getting started right now. Everybody's like really pumped up. It's the first week of the new year. People Absolutely. are ready to go on this journey. So, how do you uh, how do you kind of contain that and, and sustain that? Because it's it's difficult to uh, to you know take something because weight loss. I mean, it took you a while to gain the weight, so it's going to take a while to lose it. So how do you take that energy or what can you tell people to kind of to keep them on, on track? Because I know some people are, are like, can I do this? Sure. Yeah. I think that there's definitely a honeymoon phase uh, sometimes, just like anything else. But really the first thing to remember and we've talked about this before on our Facebook lives like Linda and I have uh, you know gone over a couple of things um, like this that uh, remember that this is about you this is you know they, they say the new year new you um, but it, this is really about you and you, you want to really um, every day just kind of take a step back and think about plan what you're going to have planning is huge you know like make sure you know what vegetables you have available that you're going to get make sure you are um, planning what power fuels and smart carbs you're to add you know sometimes um, you know a lot of people like to have a lot of variety with food and um, so Nutrisystem is not a program that is telling people to not have things we're just trying to teach you how to do it a little bit more responsibly and moderately and then in in at the same time we're really trying to uh, teach you how you can have these things together with different things so like you know if you want to switch things up every now and then maybe you have a salad with chicken as a power fuel and you throw some dried fruit on it as your smart carb you can look up different this doesn't mean that you can't have rest you know recipes in your life anymore or anything like that so um 
And then just with sustaining it, you really, I think adding variety to your plan is how you sustain it. So like, it's just like anything else. A lot of people say they don't like to have the same thing. It starts to get boring after a while um, when they're, you know, when they're doing their normal routine of um, trying to eat healthy. So same thing here, you know, add try a different fruit that you never tried try a different power fuel or food that you haven't tried before you know mix things up a bit use your creativeness there's a lot of different ways that you can transform these entrees into something else and we have a lot of recipes to teach you how to do that as well so keep the variety up well that was a beautiful segue and two we have resources online. So not only do we give you recipes and, and advice and things like that on our Facebook page and Twitter and Instagram, of course, but we also have um, on our, our website, leaf.nutrisystem.com has uh, something called Nutri Corner, and there is a place that you can go and it is all new um, for information for people that are new. And um, uh, the, the informative. Oh, thanks, Karen. And then, how are the holidays? How can I get motivated again? This is a good question. How do you get motivated again? But wanted to cover something first is before we ask about the motivated. So you know, when you're talking about the honeymoon phase and and people kind of getting started, you know, at the beginning. Don't forget to take your before photos. So a lot of times we fall For out sure. of taking photos of ourselves because we're. You know, you know, we don't really love the way that we look, but take photos and hide them. Put them on your phone where you can't see them, and then you can sort of start to see your progress. And don't be obsessive about the photos or you know anything like that. But but take because you want to take a look at your journey because it is going to take a little while, and you want to say, hey, I looked like that then, and now I look like this now, and it will be really valuable to you later on. So. Um, you want to help April with getting motivated? Sure. Hey, April. Um, I saw your comment. Uh, thanks for coming coming by. Um, yeah, that's a, that's a big question. You know, it's the holidays. Uh, hopefully, you know, you had a good one. But um, the motivation, you know, a lot of people typically have a lot of mov motivation in the beginning. It's, it's about sustaining that, uh, which becomes more the difficult part. But um, as Linda was just saying, you know, remember, like, there, uh, you want to, you, you had to set a goal. Um, and then you have to set a, some smaller goals so that you keep yourself motivated as you're going along and you hit those little milestones. Even if it's like, I want to reach, I want to lose two pounds this week, or um, I want to make sure to get uh, on a walk this week. And then a couple weeks later, I want to get on a jog, you know, something like that. Set little small goals for yourself. And as Linda was saying, um, I think that it's really important. I know that we all... Uh, the scale is definitely important to a lot of people, but think of the other things too. Like, uh, as Linda was saying, are you fitting into your clothes? You know, what are you seeing in yourself? Uh, you know, when you look in the mirror, is di different things like that to help keep you motivated. Because as you're reaching these milestones, that's going to be the thing that keep, is, uh, keeps you going. And then the other thing too is that if you're not having the exact success you wanted to have one week, don't give up. You know, don't don't fret. Like. Give us a call. Come to us on Facebook. You know, just reach out for help and um, or Twitter and and get the help that you need so that we can keep you motivated and keep you going. Give you ideas. Okay. Yeah. So great, great advice. Anyway, going to our uh, our website. There's a lot of great resources there. Um, and then, so Yolanda says, Nutrisystem frozen food. How do you know which ones are for lunch or dinner? Can they be used for both or either? Excellent question. That. Hey, Yolanda. Uh, yeah, definitely. So um, the lunches and dinners will be coordinated with your daily tracker. So color wise, and uh, so you definitely, you definitely should be able to tell which ones are our lunch and dinner. Um, we, it, it, in terms of being able to use them for either or, like if you want to move them around and have lunch for dinner and dinner for lunch, you can definitely do that. That's that's totally fine. But we wouldn't recommend having, say, like two lunches in a day and have like a lunch for lunch and a lunch for dinner, something like that. Um, that that would be the best solution there. All right, good stuff. So we did have one other question. Okay, so George started early October and dropped 23 pounds. This is great. Wow. Congratulations and congratulations, wow, Loretta. Loretta. Go, girl. That's pretty good. Sh Shauna, love Nutrisystem, was on several years ago and would love to do it again. Hey, we're here. Yep. We're, we're ready to take your call. So anyway, so upstairs are the weight loss counselors, and these folks are very dedicated, and they, um, they're they actually 
they they help people it's really fun I mean so we love our jobs because we get to help people and talk to people like yourselves but there was one more question um, that we got on the pre-call which was um, from Debbie and who wanted to know um, so she tracks through Numi so Numi is a great way to track your food so she wanted to know how does she count her extras so she gets three extras because she's not on now she's within the program a little bit so Rod you want to cover how she gets to that sure absolutely so um, Debbie uh, thanks for the question uh, with the tracking of extras on Numi you can track them at, you can track them with your meals uh, we don't have an actual section for um, you know you have you can't track them like you would track your power fuels and smart carbs so uh, you can add them within the meal or if you are uh, you can add like new items if you want to and stuff like that so uh, that would be the best way to track your extras good answers okay so uh, let's see let's we see love you David. too yeah, Shauna and then with uh, David Hill, I would suggest recipes using Nutrisystem to have different tastes available for those who've been under this pharmacy. I'm down from 354 to 265. Whoa. Wow, Ooh, you are killing it! That's awesome. So we actually do have recipes. So if you go to leaf.nutrisystem.com, we actually have recipes where you use Nutrisystem food. Like a good one is to take the macaroni and cheese and put pair it with broccoli and, and use the extra cheese sauce to make the the broccoli a little cheesy good stuff right there okay so if you go on the website don't laugh at me mm -hmm. um, so uh, so Ray Glover after holidays and loss and focus would you suggest going through through a shake week hmm, yeah a interesting question. question a lot of people are probably asking the same thing right um, we uh, if, if we do say that you can do another um, another jumpstart week turbo takeoff ever every 28 days um, but really I think that the the best thing to do would be to really think about your goals again think about why you know why you're trying to lose the weight uh, you know think about set set up small goals again um, um, it's okay to lose focus every now and then you know it does happen there's a lot of temptations out there the holidays can be tough um, but you really want to remember why you're doing this um, look back at some of your old goals that you may have set um, and just really just get started again and keep moving you know even if it's just like a little bit at a time sometimes people will um, lose focus and then you know just have to if they're like just start with uh, doing things the way that they started Nutrisystem, like the same schedule, and then they get back to switching it up again. Just get moving, you know, and then give us a call or definitely write us. We'll, get, we'll give you ideas. We can give you some sample menus, We, can, you know, as much as we can. Lao Tzu, the journey of a thousand steps begins with one, with the first step, which I probably got wrong. Okay, so my wife was on QVC with Marie Pond. Marie Osmond, maybe? Because Marie was on, on uh, New Year's Day. So that is great, Stefan. And then, oh. Okay, so, uh, sure. Ray, you were quite welcome. Yeah, you're so, welcome. Uh, and, and it is. I mean, we, we know that, that weight loss is, is tough. So we're, we're happy to, um, to help you out with that. So, um, so what else have we got? So um, the resources that we have, NutriCorner, um, any other resources that you wanted to, to share with? Oh, besides the weight loss counselors. Yeah, so. definitely. Well, you have the weight loss counselors. And then, you know, we're we're definitely on uh, the social channels. Reach out to us as well. The Leaf is awesome. Um, besides the Nutri, you know, the Nutri Corner, we have a lot of different resources available as well on there. Recipes, different tips and stuff like that. So, you know, definitely use everything available. Use it all because that's how you're going to get the most variety. Right, because we don't charge for like the meetings and that kind of stuff. What we do is we have uh, available all these resources that you can use that kind of comes with it. And then so when you sacrifice pasta or bread, I did it for sheer lust. Scott Tipton got my package from QVC today starting Monday. Go! Great, congratulations. And Riaz and Randolph lost 48 pounds. Wow. Great job, Stefan. That is so great. Thanks, so, Kirsten. No, that's, yes, Kirsten. P Great, great job. So um, didn't have to sacrifice pasta or bread. So I actually really love, what I love about Nutrisystem is that you get like, you get to have like food that you wouldn't think that you would get to have because like you kind of always feel like you have to, you know, starve yourself. So I love the sure. double chocolate muffins and those types of things. And Jilla, Jilla bought, lost 47 pounds. These are some great stories. What if I have some items I just don't like? Oh, that's a great question. So hang on, Ryan. 
Yep, Rita, definitely. We completely understand that. Um, you That's why you are able to pick if you're on like Uniquely Yours or the core program. Um, definitely go in there. Uh, you can call into counseling as well, um, or you can go online yourself and just go ahead and uh, you can pick the items that you would like. That's why we have as much of a variety as we do because we understand that people like certain things and um, you should uh, feel free to go pick the items that you would like. I know having having the stuff that you like is is really paramount and uh, no starving for sure Kirsten I know so the first week can be rough because you're really trying to transition out of hey I was eating anything I wanted and now I'm like on a kind of a more stricter path so I mean I love all that and um, so some things that we have coming up for the week tomorrow we have um, Facebook take takeover with our with our very special ambassador Melissa Joan Hart Ooh. and then we'll have another Facebook live like this next week talking about if Nutrisystem's right for you and there'll be some other questions and we'll have a have a different uh, counselor with us so any other things that you, you had coming up um, uh, we're very excited for the start of the year um, we're very happy to be a part of your weight loss journey so reach out to us we are always you know we're available as uh, as much as we can be and um, we love to hear your questions it's really great to hear from you guys uh, in the counseling department or uh, on online on Facebook and Twitter so uh, we you guys are our biggest fans and we love you so get you know reach out to us and make sure you subscribe and now one two three say happy new year one two three happy, happy new, new year, year. Bye. Bye. Thanks.